My name is Michelle DeRocher. I'm Liz Coffey. And the project that I'm working on is to create catalog records for the Harvard Film Archive in the Harvard Library catalog. So the project had two main goals, the use case being the creation of records for the Harvard Film Archive. But we really wanted some either methodologies to be developed or tools that could help us migrate data of a similar kind in the future. So whether it was text-based uh, data that was in some spreadsheets or access databases and create um, automatic batch-loaded catalog records. Uh, most of the material that I'm caring for is motion picture film, but we also have digital files, video, audio, paper, posters, photographs, equipment. Uh, we have a movie theater where we show films every week. The cataloging records are for individual items, so each, each reel of film gets an inspection report that details the physical qualities of it as well as the content. So if it's a nitrate film or if it's an acetate film with vinegar syndrome that has a lot of scratches, that will be in the record. If it's um, a pristine, brand new 35 millimeter theatrical print of Casablanca, there's a lot of technical information describing the item itself. Typically, in the old days, creation of catalog records was really a one-by-one -one kind of process, and that has long since been an unsustainable model. So what we were trying to do here is develop some tools that would help us create records in batch. And that is increasingly the mode of working that we need to try to achieve when we're representing large collections in the catalog. So since we've, um, since we've started this project, it's actually come up a couple times that other colleagues have had spreadsheets, databases with um, data that they wanted to be in the catalog and didn't know how to get there. So we were actually encountering a number of um, parallel efforts to try to solve the same problem. That's something that I hope that we can build upon for some tools that staff have ready access to.